Well, this spring, more than 40,000 music lovers will flock to New Orleans to enjoy the world's largest music festival. Here to give us a preview of the Jazz Fest is guitarist Zach Feinberg. Zach, many people don't realize just how big, I mean, they know about all oh, the Jazz Fest in New Orleans and it's a, a great party, but they don't realize just how big this festival is and how much it's about so much more than just music. Yeah, uh, the, the festival is huge. There's, there's over 400 performers uh, every year performing at it, uh, including my band, The Revivalists. And uh, we also have Aerosmith headlining. We have Khalid. We have Jimmy Buffett. We have Sting, David Byrne, Lionel Richie, LL Cool J. Uh, tons of great local bands, um, not to mention all of the night shows uh, at, at all the venues and, and clubs around town. Well, and for, for you, that's the thing. I, I, I wonder what, you know, when you're not performing, you have your stage time that you guys are going to go on and play, but are you guys getting out and enjoying the rest of the festival? And what are you seeing out there around the festival grounds? Oh, absolutely. Uh, I, I try to come make it to the fairgrounds uh, if I'm in town uh, several times. Um, besides checking out some headliners that I want to see, like I definitely want to see Sting, I, uh, I, every year I really just like to wander around and, and, and find some new artists that I've never heard of. Um, that's one of the great things about Jazz Fest. Um, you know, we, we started playing this stage, the, the first slot, you know, at 11 in the morning. And um, walking around to the jazz tent or the gospel tent or the blues tent or the Fado Do stage um, and, and really just discovering some amazing new artists is, uh, is, is part of what it's about. And uh, you could do that really any time of the year um, in, in on Frenchman Street or, or any of the local clubs in town. That's, that's something I really enjoy to do, doing. And musicians everywhere. I mean, there's there's places in the in the states, Austin, Texas, New Orleans, you know, Nashville. That you know, these music kind of capitals that musicians all flock to. Talk a little bit about, from a musician standpoint, what it is about New Orleans that draws you there. I don't think there's a better live music city in the country, possibly the world, than than New Orleans, Louisiana. Um, every night of the week, every every night of the year there's going to be an amazing live band playing uh, in New Orleans. We have hundreds of music venues um, which is really what drew me to New Orleans the fact that there's such a, a vibrant live local music scene here. Um, if you want to play you can and uh, for more information on that make sure you check out NewOrleans.com for, for upcoming uh, events and things like that. Well, yeah, NewOrleans.com probably uh, is going to talk a lot about their celebrating their 300th birthday this year. So I'm sure they got uh, I'm sure they got stuff all year long. Have you seen any of the, the things they have lined up? Yeah, the the tricentennial. The, this we're, we're celebrating that. Um, there's always a million festivals and, and celebrations and parties in this town, but especially for the tricentennial, we're really amping it up. I, I went to a, a National Geographic uh, special last week and. They focused on on some some really cool things going on in the city, like uh, nonprofits. The Roots of Music is one that uh, I'm a big supporter of. The band is a big supporter of. They focused on uh, on, on, on special bartenders and, and and furniture makers. Things like that is are all featured actually here at the fair, fairgrounds too. There's an artist village. There's uh, there's local food that you can get at the festival. Um, crawfish bread, gumbo, jambalaya oysters. It's all here. Um, it's, it's all, all a good, good time. All a good time, Zach. I really appreciate yeah. you joining us and uh, tell the band, continue shining like a star. We all know who you are. I appreciate your time with us this oh, morning, Oh, you know. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Curtis. Is, I don't know. Very cool. Mm -hmm. Special thanks to New Orleans Convention and Visitors Bureau for bringing us that amazing interview there. That was good stuff.